I just returned from Target and I picked up some sunscreens and some Christmassy items that I thought you might be interested in seeing. I don't know. And then I'll show you something that I picked up from Starbucks. <laughs> okay, and our Target does not have a Starbucks in it. I have to go to Ingles for Starbucks. What do you want to see first? Sunscreen or Christmassy items? Let's do Christmassy items first. Milano Amaretto Hot Cocoa. I love the mint ones, so I have a feeling I'm going to love these amaretto ones. Oh my goodness. 130 calories and two cookies. I'm going to have to fight my son for these, maybe. He loves these too. Mm. We love hot chocolate as a family. Let's see if I can do this without making a lot of noise. <laughs> White chocolate coated stirs with marshmallows. Look how cute. Uh, there are four in here, and it's like white chocolate with marshmallows attached to stir your hot chocolate. How cute is that? Also for hot chocolate, snowflake marshmallows. These are both by that brand Favorite Day. They had a lot of cute little toppers. They had ones that marshmallows that look like uh, stockings. They had ones that were like a chocolate mint cookie with peppermint on the top that you could put on. They had several different options, but my kids are picky. <laughs> so I went with plain ones with the cute shapes. I picked up also from Favorite Day, this one, freeze dried strawberries in dark chocolate. Oh my goodness, you guys, I love these. If I hadn't just had, like when I came home from Target, I made the crust, crusties, crustays, I don't know how you say that, uh, chocolatey chocolate chip muffins. <laughs> so I just ate one of those. If I hadn't, I would have broken into these. Also from favorite day, chocolate chip mini cookies. These reminded me of the Trader Joe ones. Our Trader Joe's is like an hour away, but these remind me of the little Trader Joe ones. So I picked these up. Yeah, I got a lot of, of snacky snack stuff. For my daughter's classroom, I picked up these chewy holiday minis, chocolate chip granola bars with sprinkles, 28 in a pack. Thought that was festive. Give that to our class for snacks. I love the car canister Kleenexes. I know these cost more, but they just sit right in my cup holder. And they had, uh, Christmas ones. We've got nutcrackers and Christmas tree ornaments and presents and holly on that one. Can't show you that one. Can't show you that one without the stocking stuffers. <laughs> I picked this up as a gift. Always, we always need random gifts for people. Do you guys need to do that? Look how beautiful this is. This is um, the M&S. They had a whole display in Target that was uh chocolates and stuff and snacks from M&S, which is English, right? British, British brand. We got some shortbread cookies last year from them that were delicious. But these are Belgian chocolate luxury cookies. I want to say this was, is this 20 or 15? It wasn't too bad, but I just thought this was a beautiful design with the peacocks. That would make a, just a gorgeous gift for somebody that we've forgotten to get a gift for. What are the cats meowing at? Are you okay? I don't know what you're doing. I don't have anything for you. All right, so that was the end of the snacky snacks I got. Sunscreens. I know it's fall. <laughs> and I just came, actually came back from my dermatologist appointment. I don't know what to do with my hair. My dermatologist, my six month dermatologist appointment. I, if that video is already up. I will link it in a card up here. If it's not, it's coming. I don't know if this video will post first or the other one. So I picked up sunscreens that I've seen you all mention in the comment sections, but I've never actually tried <laughs> because they were having some kind of a deal where if you bought so many personal care items, then you got like a percentage off of all of them. So I did that. Aveeno Calm and Restore Daily Moisturizer SPF 30, fragrance-free, sensitive skin, lightweight, all-day moisture. Somebody mentioned this Calm and Restore line. 
you know I like the common protect line, right? Is it protect, common protect or protect and restore? With the SPF 60 chemical sunscreen that I absolutely love. Well, this is a different line. This is a new, it says new. <laughs> so I don't know how new. Common restore, uh, zinc oxide, titanium dioxide. Oh, it has a lot of zinc in it, 12.5%. So this is fragrance-free, paraben-free, alcohol-free, hypoallergenic, non-comedogenic, blends into all skin tones. So anyways, interested in purchasing that one. I mean, in trying that one. Somebody mentioned the Vanny Cream. Now, I tried the Vanny Cream lip balm, mineral lip balm, and did not like it. It just left my my lips white. Uh, I did a whole video where I tried out a bunch of mineral sun uh, lip balm sunscreens. <laughs> I'll link that video right here for you. You gotta watch that one. That was pretty fun. Is this one already open? Did I buy an open one? Um, it looks okay. <laughs> Fragrance free for sensitive skin. Two point five ounces. You get a lot more. SPF. 30 has ceramides in it, 19.5% zinc oxide. So I fully expect this to be white, but it is sealed. So, okay, so I'll try that one. Let me know, I've got two more to show you. Let me know which ones you want me, which one you want me to test out first. This is what I want to show you at Starbucks before I show you the last two sunscreens. <sighs> Isn't this gorgeous? Look how pretty. It's like a coppery rose, rose gold if that makes sense. I'm a sucker for Starbucks cups. I only have three right now though. <laughs> I have three Starbucks ones like this. And I think I have three or four Wa the Walmart version ones. I also like those, but I just thought this one was absolutely gorgeous. Okay. All right. I picked up again, somebody mentioned in the comments, one of you view viewers, the Cetaphil Sun Sheer Mineral Face. Uh, SPF 50, water resistant 80 minutes. It says ideal for use under makeup, vitamin E, 12% zinc oxide, won't clog pores, ultra lightweight formula, dry matte finish. Okay. And it's accepted by the National Eczema Association. Well, at least this one tells us that it's going to be a matte finish. This one did not say... And this one did not say. Okay. And then the last one, I think this one's been out for a while, but I avoided it in the summer because it said hydration. And I was worried that it was going to be too moisturizing for my skin during the summer months. I don't know. I don't think anybody mentioned this one to me. This is the Hawaiian Tropic Oil-Free Sunscreen Weightless Hydration Face, 12 hours of moisturization SPF 30. All chemical sunscreen, avobenzone, homosalate, octosalate, octocrylene. And it does come in a pump. I think this was the cheapest one. I'll be interested to see if it has that typical Hawaiian tropic scent. All right, so which, which one of these should I test first? <laughs> Let me know. Today's a great day to wear sunscreen. I'm wearing the Toddy Toddy T-O-T-Y mineral sunscreen. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.